March 22nd, 2019, I was at the Hangar OC Events Center in Costa Mesa, California, when I met Kubrat Pulev for the first time ever. I was there for the weigh-in. I asked him if we could do an interview for Vegas Sports Daily. He said yes. We did a pre-fight interview. The next day, March 23rd, 2019, after the fight between Kubrat and Bogdan Dunuk, I asked Kubrat for a post-fight interview. He said yes. I conducted the interview in a backstage area inside his tent. I started the interview. Mid-interview, he grabbed my face and kissed me. I was immediately shocked and embarrassed and didn't know how to respond. Next, I walked to a table to put my items in my backpack. He grabbed both of my buttocks and squeezed with both of his hands. Then he walked away without saying anything to me and laughed. It made me feel uncomfortable and frustrated that Kubrat Pula would treat me in such an unprofessional manner. I did not encourage or consent to Mr. Pula grabbing my face, kissing me, or grabbing my backside. I was there at the event covering the boxing match as a professional member of the press. Kissing a woman on her lips without her consent and grabbing her is not acceptable. Later that night, a friend invited me to an after party. There was an opportunity to interview more fighters and therefore I decided to go. Mr. Pulev did not join until the very end of the night. He acted like nothing happened, but later at the party, he asked me to remove the kiss from the interview. I did not remove it, and instead I posted it because I wanted people to see what he had done to me. I wanted him to be accountable. I didn't want him to get away with it. What he did to me was disgusting. I felt humiliated. No woman should be treated this way. Mr. Pulev and I were not friends and we're not in romantic relationship. He had no right to kiss me.